Today on another pop review, we're taking a look at the Pop Disney 298 Darkwing Duck Goslin Mallard. So stay tuned. Hey guys, welcome back to Comic Gun TV where all geek culture collides. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on future videos. Alright guys, as I said today, we're taking a look at the Pop Disney Darkwing Duck number 298 Goslin Mallard vinyl figure. Now this completes the hero line of the Darkwing Duck line of pups. As you know, we've already taken a look at Darkwing Duck, and we've taken a look at Launchpad McQuack, and now the final one, Goslin Mallard. As you can see here, a nice little display image here, Goslin. I, however, like to display them this way. I like the background there. Really nice. Goslin is, of course, the adopted daughter of Drake Mallard, a.k.a. Darkwing Duck. You have 296 here, Darkwing. 297 is Launchpad. 298 is Goslin. Collect them all. Real quick, let's get the other two. Show you how they display. There's a nice little display there. It would have been nice, though, uh, if Funko did, like, a uh, entire cityscape to where when you collect them all, it's like a puzzle. Uh, that would re be really nice. I can understand why they wouldn't do that, though. Um, because you never know how people like to display their pops. Some, some display them like this, some display them out of the box, some display them like I do, like this, you just never know. Uh, others may even display them stacked on top of each other. So let's go ahead and move these guys out of the way. And we'll go ahead and open Goslin up. Very nice looking pop. As you can see, as usual, her head turns all the way around. Nice little pigtails there. Or duck tails. Ooh! <laughs> I know, dad joke. <laughs> got her number one jersey there. She's got no pants. Purple Converse tennis shoes and socks. Very nice looking pop. I really like it. Uh, now I'm going to have to get Webby next for my DuckTales collection. Can't have just one female in the group. Gotta have multiples. Otherwise the one feels left out. And here we have all three heroes from the Darkwing Duck line. As you can see, Goslin stands quite a bit taller than Darkwing, uh, which I don't really care for. She should be smaller than Darkwing, so they should have probably made Launchpad maybe a deluxe, an oversized pop, um, and then made Darkwing maybe about Launchpad's size now, and then kept uh, Goslin uh, that size, or even made her smaller, about the size of Darkwing. As you can see, her beak does stand a lot lower than Darkwing's. Uh, however, her head is a lot bigger, which makes her stand a lot taller. Um, yeah, I don't really care for that. Luckily, I'm not an out of the out of the box collector, so it, it it's not going to be too bad since I'm not an out of the box collector. Um, Displaying them on the sides, on the display sides, like I like. Uh, it, I doubt it would really even be noticeable. So there you have it, guys. The Pop Disney Darkwing Duck number 298, Goslin Mallard. As I said, this completes the Heroes line of the Disney Darkwing Duck line of Pops. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to get the villains or not. Uh, I've st on the DuckTales line, I've still got to get Huey, Dewey, Louie, and Webby. Uh, so maybe I'll get those guys first, and then I'll consider getting the villains. 
I'm Shannon for Come Again TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on another episode. We do pop reviews every Tuesday right here on Come Again TV. Take care, everyone.